Hello and welcome to my tutorial on how to create a weapons dispenser and hammer for C construct source. Start off by making a basic map with two spawns, terrorist and CT, and just add wherever you want to it. <laughs> but the main part is that I'm going to show you how to make a dispenser. So create a simple dispenser looking type of thing and once you've created the dispenser uh, go to entities then go to sorry entities then go to point template and create a point template put it, put it somewhere on the map I'll put mine there see and then once you've done that go back to entity creation tool go to the bottom of the list and get any w any of the weapons I've chosen a weapon USP now that you've got your point template and your weapon all you need now is a button so go to block creation tool and create a button somewhere near your dispenser once you've created it you need to press alt enter on it name it wherever you want I've named mine weapon underscore spawner click apply to make it so the button doesn't move when you press it. Go to flags and click don't move. Make sure it's checked and make sure use activate. It activates is checked. If you want touch activates or damage activates or toggle or sparks or start locked or anything like that, just check them. Click apply. Now go to the USP, which is inside your dispenser, or should be. Click on it. Alt enter. Name it USP or whatever the hell you want. It doesn't really matter. And go to flags. And if you want it so it stays where it is instead of falling, click start constraint. I'm not going to make it like that because I want mine to fall and go out the bottom. Okay, now to make it so the weapon will spawn with extra ammo, you need to go to click on the smart edit so it goes to standard edit. Then click add. And then you need to add a new key value called ammo key is called ammo and the value is 300 well it can be anything to be honest, it's going to be 1, that will give you 1 extra bullet or 999 but I've made mine 120 and just click apply and go to the point template now once you're on the point template oh, wrong thing, alt enter on it name it USP template underscore template or wherever you really want to and then click apply and go to template one and name it and then no sorry don't name it click on the list button and click on the name of the USP which is USP for me then click apply then go back to the button click on it alt enter and then click on flags not flags sorry outputs and then click on add my output is named on pressed target entity named and then USP template and then force spawn for via this input force spawn then click apply what's that telling it to do is that every time you press that button the template there will tell the USP to create itself okay now that I've done that I just need to run the map 